for the first time in person. Um, I was like at her studio and she was like doing her glam and stuff. And Were you then nervous? I was nervous. Yeah, but I was like, I was like chilling. I was like nervous to get there. Once I got there, I was like, okay, I'm chilling. But then I heard her like say something and then I got nervous. <laughs> and then she started, she came out, right? Yeah. And um, I was fine. But she came out and she looked at like uh, my manager, James and like Riot and stuff and my photographer and everything. And um, then she came at me. And when she came to me wow. and she hugged me, I started crying because it just felt like a, a, I, I cried, but I walked away. Like I didn't say anything to her. I was just like, and I just walked away because um, I was just like, bro, like, like just the journey. Like, you know, I love Nikki and like meeting her was great and everything. But for me, it also just mostly felt like this is a full circle moment. Right. Like, this is crazy. Right. Like, I'm listened. really here. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yes, like, little that, me is screaming. That kid who listened to music and felt that music and made you realize anything was possible, you reached one of your destinations. Yes. And it just, it felt like such an, like, an accomplishment meeting her, like, in a way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because, of course, so many girls look up to her and want to do that. But it's just, like, for you to do it, it's just crazy. Yeah, but you felt it in a moment and, it, and turned it into something tangible.